Hello, this is Satoshi, and today I'd like to talk about a problem that I got on one of my projects on Logic Pro 10. Uh, it happened a few days ago. This is a song for my solo project, Echoscape. And as you can see, there are rectangular shapes here and there. And these are white noise blasts. Uh, I didn't have this when we recorded it. Um, these are on drum tracks. We didn't have these in the beginning um, until now, and now they're here. Let's hear what it sounds like. Well, so just like that. Also, funny thing is, you can only see it when you zoom in, but if I zoom out, it's gone. Yeah, there you go. So it's it's strange. And another thing I know is that if I export it as a new audio file and then it's gonna show the, the block even if I zoom out. But right now it doesn't. So when we recorded it, um these drums are played my friend Justin Werbonski and we recorded at the rehearsal space in Brooklyn, New York and I brought in two audio interfaces um, and I put them together as a aggregate device because we needed six tracks and we didn't have any um, six track six input interface so uh, this came up as an idea. Uh, Mac OS allows you to put multiple interfaces together. And here um, I used one. One is Focusrite Scarlett 2i2, and the other one is Resident Audio Thunderbolt T4. And when we recorded it, everything was fine. Um, it recorded everything perfectly. And since then, I overdubbed other tracks like vocals, guitar bass and I didn't hear any noises like that and then just a few days ago I checked the project and um, they just started up here so it's very strange and another thing I know is this uh, actually modified the source file source audio file um, it's here this one so June 12th is when we recorded it, and since then it hasn't been modified according to this. But there is a white noise. And here, this is a backup on my external hard drive, and I have the version of the same, same project. But little, little older than this, so they they aren't the same version. And here I have the same snare drum file. So it doesn't it doesn't have the noise. And modify date, create it date, it's the same. For me to fix this issue, obviously I can just copy and paste the old older version to the current one just to override them and it should be fine but in the future if anything like this happened then I don't know how I can fix it um, potentially the cause is the aggregate device possibly because that's the only difference between the drum tracks and vocal other tracks like vocals, guitars because uh, those I only use one single interface but Again, um, when we recorded it, we didn't have any issues like that. So um, I'm also wondering um, if this is a bug f coming from the Logic Pro. So, uh, but I can't be sure. I looked through online and I didn't quite find any um, anybody uh, having the same issue. There are some forums with title "White Noise Blasts." But it didn't quite say that it's the same issue. 
So if anybody out there is having the same issue, something similar, feel free to comment on the video. That will be appreciated. Yep. Uh, thank you for watching.